Michigan rolled to the 27-point win on Saturday without head coach Jim Harbaugh, of course suspended for the first three games. He watched the win at assistant coach Sharon Moore's house, who was serving his one-game suspension. Harbaugh said they made the best of it, Moore's wife providing sandwiches. And as the head coach and play caller watched and discussed what they felt should happen, more times than not, that was the play called by acting head coach Jesse Minter and quarterbacks coach Kirk Campbell. Plenty of tributes to Harbaugh on Saturday from the train formation and the free Harbaugh t-shirts. Head coach got the message and was touched. Yeah, I, I, I felt the love uh, from them just doing them. You know, uh, I could see it in our players. I could see it in our coaches. Um, and, and that's what I want them to do. I want them to do them. Do, do you uh, is the way we say it around here. Um, and that's why I'm having fun. So I'm executing and and playing good and yeah felt the love from them and the, the Michigan faithful I don't know that you can quantify it but yeah we certainly certainly miss them I mean it's part of uh you know it's like you, you have a, a family gathering for a holiday or something you don't have you know a, a, a parent or an uncle or an aunt there or a grandparent that's normally there it's it's weird you're accustomed to doing things with your with your family and um you know, that being said, you carry on and you, you have the meal or the celebration or whatever, but definitely makes you appreciate, uh, you know, appreciate it even more when they're back and you get to, to do the thing that you love with the people that you love. So we'll be excited when that time comes and excited to have Coach Moore back this week. Colonel Minnick, who you know I'm uh, lifelong friends with, uh, he, uh, he sent me a message and he said that um, there's a military saying that the truest sign of your leadership is what your unit does when you aren't there. And for us, I thought it was, I thought it was really great. Our captains, our senior leadership, our coaches, all um, were phenomenal. When I when we started fall camp, I told the uh, the team that Moses had 70 leaders. How many do you think we need? More. We need we need a lot more, and um, and I think we have that. And it's building.